Hi, welcome back to my channel. I'm so glad you're here today. I have got another great beginner rebounding workout for you. I'm Laura London and I help busy people get fit and fabulous at any age. So all you're going to need today is a rebounder and a light set of weights. I have a three pound set of weights. I've got a little water back there and my dog Jake is running around the house. All right, we're going to get started. We're going to take our feet about hip width apart and we're going to bounce up and down lightly. This is called a closed chain bounce when our feet do not leave the rebounder. All right, and we're just gonna start warming up, warming up those knees, the ankles, just give me some light bouncing here. It's actually, I'm looking outside. I wish you could see my view. It's gorgeous outside today here in Florida. All right, that's great. Couple more bounces. And now we're gonna add in some arms. So let's sweep our arms up over our head and back down. Let's do a few more of those. And again, our feet are staying on that rebounder. Don't worry, they're going to come off, but not yet. Let's just warm up. Give me two more arm sweeps here. One and two, great. All right, now we're gonna take our arms and we're going to start reaching forward while we bounce. And if you find yourself um, getting off balance, just slow your bounce down a little, that's all. Bend your knees and always have a nice tight core. That'll really help to keep you balanced. So here we're reaching out to each other. I can almost touch you. That's awesome. Keep it going. Let's do five more here. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay, hands to hips. And now let's really step up our bouncing a little bit. Do you feel that? You're gonna start feeling like all your muscles moving. So great, great. Work your muscles in each direction. Get your blood pumping. All right. Now we're gonna start, we're gonna start lifting up our feet just a little bit. Maybe coming off just lightly. Getting that bounce, how does that feel, right? Just that little shift takes it up another notch. You're doing great, stay with it. And I have another um, beginner rebounding video which uses a resistance band, so I'll put the link to that on this video. All right, how you doing? Good. All right, let's take our arms down by our sides and keep that balance now. We're coming off the rebounder a little. Mm-hmm, good. Couple more here, and now we're gonna add our arms. We're gonna sweep them up again. Maybe we we'll wanna open and close our feet. Let's start here. Let's just work on that open, close, open, close, just so we get that, because that's a really nice combination with our feet. Good, you feel your heart rate getting up there? It's nice, it's gentle, but we're working. Okay, now we're gonna add our arms in. Sweep, sweep, sweep. And if this is hard for you, you can just step to the side, right? No right or wrong, just doing your best. That's it. Sweeping them up and down, it's kind of like a jumping jack. Right, when we were kids, jumping jacks. All right, let's do five more here. One, two, three, four, and five. All right, let's bring it down to that bounce. Hands are on our hips, and we're gonna come to a stop. So just gently, we're going to work on some lower body. So let's put our arms out. We're going to squat down. Now, if you have trouble with your knees, then just do a tiny little squat, okay? Otherwise, we're going down 
and up. And I want this booty squeeze right here. So down, up, down, up. I can hear myself creaking a little bit. Down, down, up, down, up, down, up. Let's do five more. One, two, three, four, and five. Excellent. Hands back to hips. We're going to start that bouncing again. Now we're going to add a little twist. So this is what it's going to look like. We're twisting. Our legs are going to one side or our knees and our arms are going to the other. All right, come on and do it with me. Let's get in some twisting. Great for the core. Some spinal rotation. We've got to keep our spines healthy and young and fit. Okay? And twist to what's comfortable for your body. You know what? I'm jumping here. I can see on top of my wall unit. There's a a napkin up there. So I balled it up, threw it up there. Must have been one of my parties. Who knows? All right, that's good. Keep it twisting, twisting, and twisting. How does that feel? Your heart rate up there? Good. Let's do five more twists here. One, two, three, four, and five. All right, take it to that bounce. I think I'm losing, oh, it's my microphone that's pulling, pulling on me. All right. <laughs> now, we're going to go back and forth with our feet. So let's work on that. Kind of stepping your toes up in front of you and back. Get that feeling before we add in our hand movement, okay? Here it goes. All right, now, let's do five more. One, two, three, four, and five. Awesome, keep the feet going. This is really gonna challenge your coordination. Maybe you just wanna lift them a little bit, or if you have more, give it some more, right? Some days we do less, some days we do more. We never push our body too hard. Body smarter than we are. It will let you know. All right, that's it. Good. Keep it going here. Let's do five more. One, two, three, four, and five. All right, take it to that closed chain bound. Let's just do 10, like shooting off the mat. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's as high as we're gonna go today. All right, let's slow down that bounce till we come to a stop. Now we're gonna grab our weights. You'll notice I put my weights on a chair next to me. I didn't wanna leave them on the rebounder because I didn't want them to uh, hit my toes. So we're gonna start back with that closed chain bounce. And maybe you have one pound weight. You can still do this with no weights, or maybe you want to take it, you know, five pounds. It's up to you. Today I have three pounds. Okay. What we're going to do is we're going to bounce and we're going to open them up to a side shoulder raise as we're bouncing. Here we go. So it's that open, close, kind of that jumping jack again, except we're not going overhead. That's it. All right? Who knew you could add weight training to your rebounding? Woohoo! I did. <laughs> Great. Now this is really going to get your heart rate up there. And again, if you need to, just sidestep. All right, let's do five more. One, two, three, four, and five. All right, take those weights down to your hips. And we're still bouncing. We're going to take them in front of us, and we're going to do that twist again. So it's twist, twist. Now the weights are going to one side. So here we go. Get ready. Woo! Good. Twisting, twisting. Really good. We're working out, getting our heart rate up, 
and detoxing the body and having fun at the same time because rebounding is really fun. I love it. Okay, good. Keep it going. Five more here. One, two, three, four, and five. Good. All right. Let's keep those weights here. We'll just put them down by our sides. We'll recover for a second. If you want to take it into just a little bounce, getting your heart rate, right? My heart rate's up. All right, good. So now we're going to go into the front and we're going to lift at the same time. Okay, if that's too hard, just bounce and lift, whatever works. Here we go. It's front and tap, tap front and lift. That's it. Tap them and lift them. Tap, lift, keep it going. Woo, good job. Don't stop, don't stop. Come on, we're in this together. You got it, you got it. Couple more. If you want to, take the arms out. Just don't stop moving. Five more. Five, four, three, two, and one. Woohoo! Good job. All right, let's let that heart rate recover here. Slow down your bounce. How are you doing? Good, 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 good. All right. Woo! Now, we're going to put one weight down onto the chair, onto the floor, wherever you have it. And we're going to go into the open close and we're going to up and down, okay? Little coordination, so go slow if this is your first time. And if you're just following along, do what you can, right? Here we go. We're going to jump out and lift up. One, two, three, that's it. And just keep it going. Anytime we lift our arms woo, over our head, maybe we'll just come to here. Let's just come to here. We're using our core when our arms go up. So if you want to keep going here, go ahead or just lift it. Or maybe your lift is right here. All right, keep it going. Boom. Five more. One, two, three, four, and five. All right, bring that back down. All right, slow down that bounce. It was ready to reach over, but I didn't slow down. Gotta slow down. Gotta slow down not only on the rebounder, but in our life. Okay, so what I wanna do now is we're gonna do some overhead shoulder presses while we're bouncing. It's gonna look like this. Bounce, bounce, bounce and push. Here we go, ready? Boom. Boom. And again, depending on you, you can give it a really high bounce, but we're staying here today doing a great job. Boom. Getting a little shoulder in there. Sexy shoulder. Probably have a sexy shoulder workout somewhere in my playlist. I'm so glad you guys are here today joining me. All right, let's five more. One, two, three, four, and five. Good job. Okay. Take it down. Just bouncing. Let's slow it down so our feet are on the rebounder. Let's put those weights down to the side. All right, we're gonna wrap this up here. We're gonna do some jogging. Right, so I want these knees as high as you can bring them. I like knee slaps. <laughs> but we're gonna go full out for 30 seconds. I don't actually have my timer on me, so I'm just gonna eyeball it. But here we go, as fast as you can for 30 seconds, that's it. If you wanna travel around your rebounder, you can travel. Just keep that body moving for 30 seconds. You got it. Don't stop. We're like halfway there. I know. 30 seconds never seems so long. <laughs> All right, keep it going. We're at 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 
four, three, two, and one. Woohoo! All right. Let's just lightly bounce that out. You did good. I know your heart rate's up now. Awesome. All right. We're gonna go back into a nice twist. So twist, this one is a real big twist. Let those arms side to side flying. This is how we're gonna finish it out. Ready? Good. Keep it going. All right, here we go. 10, nine, eight, seven, yes, six, count it with me. Five, four, three, two, and one. Hands to hips, start slowing it down. Just a nice closed chain bounce. Let that heart rate come back down. We brought it up, down, up, down. Great workout, you guys did a great, great job. All right, now we're gonna stop our bouncing and we're just gonna take a nice inhale up. Follow those hands up. Break the hands down to your heart center. Exhale, cross your fingers in front of you. Keep exhaling, bring those hands up in front of you. Hands into and bring it back down to heart center. One more time, exhaling, pushing that air out. Inhale on the way up, hands together. Exhale to your heart, fold and breathe everything out. All right, raise those arms up in the air and say, I did it, I am awesome because you are. All right, I hope you enjoyed that workout today on the rebounder. This is the Bellicon rebounder. It's like you notice I can um, exercise on here and it doesn't make any noise because it has spring, um, it doesn't have springs, it has bungees instead of springs. So this is like the creme de la creme. Um, you can also visit my um, Laura London Fitness Amazon store and it has everything I use, all my workout equipment, my health, my beauty, uh, the link is down below this video. If you haven't, please subscribe. If you love this workout, share it with your friends. Tell them to come on over to Laura London Fitness on YouTube and on the internet. And it was a pleasure and an honor working out with you guys today. And I will see you on the next video. Bye-bye.